So today's video is going to be a little bit different because as you guys know I have been on this new journey to try to get more healthy and getting healthy is getting more fit because your girl has put on weight, pregnancy weight on top of disrespectful weight that I just collected over the years that I just want to get rid of and toss away and put it in my past. So uh, the amount of weight that I expect to lose is about 40 pounds because I am uh, 205 pounds. Last time I spoke to you guys about anything weight gain, I told you I was like 199, 200 pounds. And over the weekend, I have gained about three or four or five pounds. I don't know. I know I ate before I weighed the scale, but roughly that's what it says. So I want to lose about 40 pounds so that I can be somewhere in the 160s range. I tend to gain a lot more muscle than fat. So I am intending on weighing more than the average at this type of weight, if that makes sense. I don't know. So I thought I should just start documenting it and um, maybe this can be a little bit motivation for myself to look back at this video to see maybe the progression of things I want to change now I do not know what I am doing I have not been able to figure out the recipe for my particular body to lose weight I have tried many things and the main thing that I haven't been able to get down is what percentage of like macros, carbs, proteins. This is all new to me to really pay attention like the fine details in food. I am not a terrible eater. I actually love vegetables. I eat fish a lot. Mild chicken, broccoli is usually my um, routine. But um, it seems like that is not good enough. So what I intend on doing is making sure that I take in a gallon of water a day. Me and water is not best friends, but I have done it. To be honest, I have been starting to attempt to drink a water a day for the past couple of weeks. But like I said, from this past weekend and a couple of things been happening. I have two kids, if you're new to my channel, that is under two years old. One is 18 months and one is six months. So having things like that around is very hard to pay attention to and pay attention to the kids. So this journey should be interesting because I have to utilize nap times like now to be able to get in editing and uh, exercising. So I'm trying to be a snack, you know what I'm saying? I'm already snack, but I'm trying to be a snack snack. So I'm trying to rebuild my confidence. I am confident, but uh, as anyone who isn't exactly happy with their body um tend to uh be a little bit more self-conscious and i never really been really self-conscious so i don't really like this feeling so i'm deciding to change it so um over the past couple of weeks i've been trying to implement uh avocados and avocados has been my newfound favorite thing and eggs is something i never used to eat so i eat eggs every morning so i really want to figure out so if you guys have any tips on something i can eat for weight loss i know it's going to be hard to figure out what works i'm even thinking about seeing a dietitian or a nutritionist i don't really know what the difference is but i'm really trying to figure out what's going to work for my body because my body is really stubborn my mom and dad were bodybuilders so i tend to tone up really fast so i'm trying to get rid of my fupa my fupa is my problem area as well as my arms. I really don't like how big my arms is. Everyone arm, even skinny, does this. But I don't really like how big my arms have gotten. My face is a little bit more rounder. So, um, I plan on doing now some cardio. 
since I have been really stubborn about doing that and trying to gulp this down. But first in my cardio, I'm planning on doing um, some jump roping, kettlebells, stuff like that. We are in quarantine, so it's not fun. So I'm ready to work on myself. So if you want to come with me during this journey of getting fit, kind of tag along. Let's just get to it. Now, I got my jump rope, but I haven't jump roped in here, so I don't... I, don't, I can't even be sure that I know what I'm doing, but just watch me make my mistake. I'm just gonna go until I can't go no more. That So God, I did better than I did the first time. That's probably all I can do on that. I forgot to tell you guys that I just had toe surgery. I had an ankle now, so it's a little irritable. I don't want to irritate it too much. Move on to the fitness app that I'll be doing. Let's do some screen sharing so I can show you guys what I've actually been doing. Clearly, I got kids. Can you see? So this is the app that I'm working on right now. It's called Fit On, and I really like this app because it makes you feel like you have an actual personal trainer. But right now, I'm doing one of the challenges, as you can see. And these are the challenges. The challenges I'm working on right now is called Fat Burning because I'm trying to burn some fat. Um, I've been doing very well in doing the exercises, but. Uh, I kind of fell off so I have done 9 out of 18 so far so halfway there and I just kind of want to pick up where I left off here is the athletic burn it is 10 minutes probably only going to do 10 minutes right now because I am running short on time and only thing I need is a mat here we go so I want to start by warming up our joints I want you to Feel your ankles moving laterally, forward and back, all different directions. So we're only gonna hit these warm up moves one time. So make sure if something feels weird or sticky, move through that in your own time and start to move your hips in one direction. If anything clicks or cracks, don't worry about it. It's just your joints waking up. Alright, so I don't know what part I skipped that on, um, but I didn't catch her on one of the exercises, so I'm going to do that now by myself, and then go ahead and call it time, try to eat something, maybe get a coffee before the babies wake up. <sighs> the babies are still sleeping right now, I think, yeah, I think that's good, I might make me a shake. I got a ninja blender and I'm excited to use that so maybe use that as my post-workout food. Let's do this last little bit, shower and make us something. So, how you doing? So, sorry to interrupt this 
vlog but um just to let you know i didn't film nothing after that life got ahead of me and it just didn't move forward so now you're speaking with present day me and i'm a toad so that video was filmed about a month ago i actually lost this memory card i am still a work in progress so since then i still fell off i'm just letting you know the truth that's just what it is i still fell off i've been having trouble getting back into the mo motivation of things so after that video quite honestly i was on track for a, probably at least a couple of weeks about three weeks before i started to fell off we had some issues um uh, with david having to work more often and me having to watch the babies more often and it's just you know our schedules have been off balance the last couple of weeks so i haven't been keeping up with the exercises i haven't been keeping up with the water intake and that stuff so here we are today a backslider and i really do want to get back into the swing of things get my exercising right but i thought this was just a good time to end off the video by basically discussing what my plans are i know i said that i want to lose 40 pounds but i think at this point it might be 45 ish pounds that i want to lose the biggest part uh that is difficult about losing the weight is that i have this inconsistencies and people telling me about my thyroid and that could possibly make it difficult on top of i feel more muscle as far as the scale go it take a lot longer to see the benefits but honestly when i was on board i have seen like inches lost and now i know it's not there i know i gained those inches back so the plan is to honestly i want to start some challenges i've been watching a couple of people off of youtube that um i want to try out their little exercises so let me know if you guys want me to try out like certain YouTubers program because I know there's some people that has like a two week challenge, a week challenge or something like that. I want to try the jump rope one, but now after watching that video and remembering that jump roping is something else. I definitely do want to incorporate jump roping, but doing jump roping for a whole week straight that is difficult. Ugh. I don't know, but I definitely want to try different things like i want to try the drinking gallon water for a week i want to try i think her name is team something ting and she's very popular in the exercises program also the london mr london guy i want to try his two week upa challenge and different little things like that because now more than ever i have noticed my insecurity level so now it's like i have these small amounts of insecurity where i'm just like per not to see my stomach or I don't find my body as sexy as it used to be so can't do nothing but do something about it so does that make sense you can't do nothing but do something about it okay I need to find my motivation my motivation with life is just kind of blah right now but I wanted to basically still put out this video because I wanted you to see uh, where I started how it is to find people that is trying their best to lose the weight but it's, it's it's hard it's hard to lose the weight it's hard to keep the motivation it's hard to to invest and sacrifice the time so this is my introduction i hope that one day i can look back at these series of videos that i'm about to make and even this video and see that hey you know it's okay and this is where i was and to be proud of myself my future self that you know i accomplished the goal so that's the biggest thing it's been a long time since i really really worked really 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 worked hard at a goal outside of getting pregnant so uh this is my next step this is next things i want to accomplish go ahead and get out of here um but i definitely love you guys and i will see you guys in the next one mm -hmm.